From across Maryland, Virginia, and the district, this is Washington's 24-hour local news leader. News Channel 8's Live This Morning starts right now. Most adults know the importance of getting flu shots, but perhaps they're not getting all the other vaccines they need to live longer and healthier lives. Dr. Val Jones is the CEO of Better Health, and she joins us, as she does from time to time, to give us an update on what adults are doing with their recommended vaccines and why it is so important to be vaccinated against a variety of problems later in life. Good to see you again, Doctor. Thanks you for again. joining us. We focus on getting our kids vaccinated and we're pretty good as a, as a society about doing that. Not nearly so good when we get of a certain age to get vaccinations that, that are just as effective as what we're giving our kids. It's unbelievable. This is actually National Adult Immunization Awareness Week, and that's <laughs> quite a mouthful. And we're here to give a little love to the other vaccines out there besides the flu. We've heard a lot about that. And do you know that rates for vaccines are pretty dismal? They're as low as 7% for the shingles vaccine, for example, Amazing. we're up to 60% for the pneumonia vaccine and 66% for flu. So there's a lot of work that we still need to do for adults. We do a reasonable job uh, with, with the flu vaccine. But again, if only 60% of the adults are getting it, uh, that's a significant number of Americans out there that are walking around without uh, protection against the, the uh, the seasonal vaccine and what we know is that every year between 40 and 50,000 Americans die from the flu a preventable disease as it turns out exactly it's it's amazing that 50,000 Americans are dying <clears throat> each year of, of vaccine preventable illnesses so it's super important for people to go to their doctors make sure that they're up to date on their vaccines and ask them about those other vaccines that they might need those other 10 I asked you during the break what was the the one vaccine that that Americans should be getting that we're not and you without hesitation said a shingles vaccine if you don't know what shingles is if you've never seen anyone who has it you will remember after the fact this is a terrible disease very painful, hard to get rid of, and you can get protected by a shock. Exactly. Now, it's, it's, it's a super important vaccine. There are others that are important, mm -hmm. too, but I see people in my office all the time who come in and say, I am having the worst headache of my life. I think I'm having a brain aneurysm, yeah. one person told me. And the truth of the matter was they had had a little bit of a, a blistering rash on their scalp that they didn't think anything about. And then they left it alone and it developed into this terrible headache that was post herpetic neuralgia from shingles. And it's so difficult to treat. So getting vaccinated is one great way to prevent it. And if you do have a funny rash and a lot of pain, immediately because medicines can head off the pain syndrome at the pass. And don't say it can't happen to you because if you've had chicken pox, you're at much higher risk for developing shingles later on. It turns out to be the same bug. Uh, let's talk about a couple of other uh, vaccines real quickly. Uh, pneumonia vaccine, widely touted, very effective, and not many people are taking advantage. Well, we're at about 60% uh, for the pneumonia vaccine, the Pneumovax it's called, um, and anyone over the age of 65 should really be getting this vaccine. Also another important vaccine is HPV for young women, and we're only at about 10% of women have had one of the series of three, and that can prevent cervical cancer. Do you come down on the everyone getting HPV because there's a, a, a medical controversy of sorts about that right now? I think it's a good thing for people to choose to do if you're in the so long as there are no contraindications. Okay, again, the message on immunization doesn't stop at age 12. We should be getting these things throughout our life, and it's an important message to get. GetBetterHealth.com, a website for a lot of terrific information. Dr. Val Jones, thank you so much. As always, nice to see you. Thank you.